Hey YouTube, this is Desmond here, and uh, this is my messy computer setup. It's not actually what I brought you here to show you. I was going to tell you, I went to a dual terminal today and bought a bunch of dual terminal 4 stuff. Um, I posted a lot of it on my eBay store, but I've got a lot that is also not on my eBay store yet. And um, there's some stuff that I pulled that's not going to be for trade. Like, I pulled an ancient flame bell deity and gave it to my girlfriend. Or actually, I traded it for something that she pulled, rather. And um, I got like a Cerberell and a Fabled Unicorn, two Chawas. A bunch of fabled stuff that I'm gonna hold on to, but I mean, here's some um, what's up for a trade and sell because none of this is on eBay. Some of this may end up on eBay eventually, so I guess just act fast. And um, especially anything you see in this pile that's also in my eBay pile, it's gonna be on eBay once the other one is bought. So um, let's just get started. I'll take trades or cash for these, but I definitely prefer cash right now because I am kind of hurting for it. Royal Oppression, Instant Fusion. Assault Armor, two um, Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon, two Rigorous Reaver, a Nightmare Penguin, Wall of Illusion, Blade Knight, Genex Ally Chain, um, Crusher, Gray Squirmer. This guy's effect is sick. He'd be good dark support. Um, Flame Wingman. I realize he's still Terminal Three. I got him as a trade. Um, dark Bright, uh, Terra Firma, Dragon and Militum. Uh, definitely, this might be on eBay pretty soon. But I mean, you can still bid or buy from there. And a Garuda. And then for what's on my eBay store right now, some of this is not dual terminal. This is just, I'm just going to go through the whole Yu Gi Oh stack. Oh, I got more over here. Let's see. Different Dimension Dragon, GX Allies Changer, and Defender of the Ice Barrier. And then I got a whole other huge stack right here Royal Oppression, Trap Dust Shoot, King of the Swamp. These guys aren't in top loaders, but I mean, they're separate, they're safe, don't worry about it. I'll make sure that they end up in top loaders very soon. I just, uh, all the top loaders that were on my desk were used, I'm going to get up and get more probably right after this video. Dragon Noob Javelin, two of them. Dragon Noob Partisan, two of them. Dragon Noob Knight Trident, Naturia White Oak, Naturia Landois, Neo Flame Bell Garuda, Neo Flame Bell Saber, and then um, not dual terminal. Uh, an ultra rare Silva um, of Dark World, a super rare Gold of Dark World, an ultra rare Locomotion Argenex dual terminal, and a Dragon Emity Legionnaire dual terminal. And um, that's about it. I actually share my store with some other people, so um, if you see, if you ever see anything up there that's not related to Yu-Gi-Oh, I mean, still feel free to buy it. Just know that I probably didn't post it, but. Um, yeah. Once again, this has been designated. Just um, showing you some of the stuff I got at the dual terminal. And um, oh, oh, let me show you something that I am really excited about, even though I can't play it yet. And um, some of you may know that I'm actually pretty excited about this. If you watch my flame bell discussion, or I mean, fable discussion. I don't know why I said flame bell. Completely unrelated. Oh well. It's my. Oh, it's not back there. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay. Here's some of the fabled stuff I ended up with at the end of today. I pulled everything except the Cerberell. I am um, traded for that. Unicorn. Cerberell. Two Chawa. Cockator. Cat Sith. And two Ganesha. None of this is for trade. I just, um,. Showing you because I'm really excited, I guess. But um, that's actually um about it. I'm very excited about especially these two guys. Serpero is a level two that summons himself when he's discarded. He's a tuner. Right now, this guy's like twenty dollars, so I was really excited to get a hand on him. Leviathan is a level four with twenty three hundred attack, and in and of itself, that's or Unicorn is a level four. I don't know why I said Leviathan. That's the level ten, way other end of the scale. But um, he'll probably be taking the place of my armory arm. And uh, he's got 2300 attack, which is good in and of itself. But if you have the same number of cards in your hand as I do while he's on the field, all of your um, spells, traps, and effect monster effects are negated. So this guy pretty much fucks you over if I have him on my side of the field. Because it's, I have so much hand control, it's not hard for me to get there. Especially if you have no cards in your hand. It's so easy for me to dump my hand. So I mean... And just get this kid out. 
then push for the OTK and you can't do anything about it. So I'm very excited about him. And, um, you know, the the fabled stuff is really going to push fables into the top tier. And I'm excited about it. But, um, anyways, rate, comment, subscribe. Um, just, uh, you know, normal YouTube thing. So I got a Midoriya as like, kind of like a last second thought. I've got tons of commons all over the place, but, um, I can't really go through them all right now. I have a play set of Origin, but I haven't decided what I'm doing with it. So, yeah. And, um, you know, like I just said, rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, all those cool YouTube things. I love you guys. And um, I will see you guys later. Thanks.